The adoption of plug-in electric vehicles in the France is actively supported by the French government through a bonus malus system and other incentives. The government provides subsidies towards the purchase of all electric vehicles and plug-in hybrids with low CO2 emissions. The French government also set up a national purchase incentive scheme for all electric utility vans. As of December 2017, the stock of light duty plug in electric vehicles registered in France since 2010 totaled almost 150,000 units. The country, as of December 2016, ranked as the second largest plug in market in Europe after Norway, and the world's fifth. As of December 2017, the French plug-in electric stock consisted of 92,256 all-electric passenger cars, 25,269 all-electric utility vans, and 32,272 plug-in hybrids. The split among type of powertrain is influenced by the rules of the government subsidies, which favors pure electric vehicles over plug in hybrids. The market share of all electric passenger cars increased from 0.30% of new car registered in 2012 to 0.49% in 2013, and reached 0.59% in 2014. Until 2013, most plug-in cars sold in France were pure electric cars, but from 2015, sales of plug-in hybrid cars rose significantly. After the introduction of super bonus for the scrappage of old diesel power cars in 2015, sales of both segments of plug-in cars surged, and for the first time the French plug-in market share passed the 1% mark, ending 2015 with a market share of 1.17% of total new car registrations that year. The plug-in market share climbed to 1.40% of new car registrations in 2016, and achieved a record market share of 1.98% in 2017. As of December 2015, France ranked as the country with the world's largest market for light-duty electric commercial vehicles. Nearly half of the vans sold in the European Union are sold in the country. The market share of all electric utility vans reached a market share of 1.22% of new vans registered in 2014, and 1.30% in 2015. The Renault Zoe has led all electric car sales in France since 2013, and is the country's all time best selling plug in electric car with 48,582 units registered since 2012 through December 2017. The Renault Kangoo ZE utility van ranks second after the Zoe, and it is the all-time top-selling electric van with 15,032 units registered since 2010. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Government incentives. Since 2008 France has a bonus malus system offering a financial incentive, or bonus, for the purchase of cars with low carbon emissions, and a fee, or malus, for the purchase of high emission vehicles. The bonus applies to private and company vehicles purchased on or after 5 December 2007 and is deducted from the purchase price of the vehicle. The malice penalty applies to all vehicles registered after 1 January 2008, and is added at the time of registration. Since 2009, every family with more than two children receives a deduction from the malice of 20 grams of CO2 per kilometer per child. Topic. 2012-2014. Until July 31, 2012, a premium up to €5,000, under the bonus malice system, was granted for the purchase of new cars with CO2 emissions of 60 grams per kilometre or less which benefited all electric cars and any plug-in hybrid with such low emissions. Vehicles emitting up to 125 grams per kilometre or less, such as conventional hybrids and natural gas vehicles, were granted up to €2,000. 
the incentive could not exceed 20% of the sales price including VAT, increased with the cost of the battery if it is rented. Effective on August 1, 2012, the government increased the bonus for electric cars up to €7,000 but capped at 30% of the vehicle price including VAT. The price includes any battery leasing charges, and therefore, electric cars which need a battery leasing contract also are eligible for the bonus. For example, an electric car sold for €23,333 including VAT was eligible for the maximum bonus of €7,000. The emission level for the maximum bonus was raised to 20 grams per kilometer or less. Cars with emission levels between 20 and 50 grams per kilometer were eligible to a bonus of up to 5,000 euros, and between 50 and 60 grams per kilometer were eligible to a bonus of up to 4,500 euros. After this limit, the bonus dropped to 550 euros. The fee schedule for the bonus malice was modified in 2013. Effective November 1, 2013, the bonus was reduced from €7,000 to €6,300 for all electrics and any other vehicle with CO2 emissions of less than 21 grams per kilometre. Vehicles emitting between 21 and 60 grams per kilometer, such as plug-in hybrids and conventional hybrids, were eligible to a bonus up to 4,000 euros, and for emissions between 61 and 90 grams per kilometer up to 150 euros, down from 550 euros. Effective January 1, 2014, the fee schedule for the malice was increased to a maximum penalty of €8,000 from €6,300 for vehicles emitting over 200 grams per kilometre. A neutral class applied to vehicles emitting between 91 to 130 grams per kilometre. Topic. 2015-2016 From April 1, 2015, a super bonus was introduced, increasing the financial incentive to a cumulative total of €10,000, consisting of the regular bonus of €6,300 for purchasing a pure electric car, plus up to €3,700 for customers scrapping a diesel-powered car in circulation before 1 January 2001. In the case of plug-in hybrids with CO2 emission levels between 21 and 60 grams per kilometer, the purchase bonus is €4,000 plus the scrapping premium of €3,700. Also a specific €500 Euros grant was introduced for families which are below the income tax threshold who buy an ordinary new or second-hand car below certain CO2 emission thresholds or a hybrid or electric car. Effective January 4, 2016, the €6,300 purchase bonus limited to 27% of the purchase price for vehicles emitting up to 20 grams per kilometre was kept. This bonus corresponds to pure electric vehicles and those equipped with a range extender. Vehicles emitting between 21 and 60 grams per kilometer were entitled to a €1,000 bonus. This bonus corresponds to the majority of plug-in hybrids. Conventional hybrid passenger cars emitting between 61 and 110 grams per kilometer with sufficient level of hybridization, with an electric motor with an output power of not be less than 10 kilowatts, are entitled to a 750 euros bonus. The 10,000 euros super bonus for the purchase or lease of a new all-electric car was maintained. To be eligible for the additional scrappage bonus, the old diesel-powered car have to be owned for at least a year and in circulation before 1 January 2006. The new vehicle must not be sold within six months of acquisition or have traveled less than 6,000 kilometers 3,700 miles. The scrappage bonus for the purchase of pure electric cars was maintained at 3,700 euros, while the bonus for plug-in hybrid car emitting between 21 and 60 grams per kilometer was set at 2,500 euros. Only individuals or professionals are eligible for the scrappage bonus. 
Commercial vehicles are not eligible. Neither demonstration vehicles are eligible to the superbonus unless the vehicles are sold or leased within one year following the date of first registration. As of September 2016, the scrappage bonus of €3,700 for trading in old diesel-powered cars has been granted to more than 10,000 purchase transactions. Topic. 2017 proposal As of September 2016, the government proposal to be in force from 1 January 2017 provides that the €10,000 super bonus for scrapping a diesel vehicle over 10 years old will be renewed. However, the bonus for the purchase of a pure electric car will drop to €6,000 from €6,300 in 2016, but to compensate, the additional scrappage bonus will be increased to €4,000 from €3,700 in 2016. Also, the government plans to introduce a purchase price cap to the vehicles eligible for the bonus, and to introduce a new bonus for two-wheeled motor vehicles. For the more polluting vehicles, the government intends to increase the maximum malice fee to €10,000 from €8,000 in 2016 for vehicles emitting more than 191 grams per kilometer, lowering the limit from 200 grams per kilometer in 2016. The government intends to maintain the €1,000 purchase bonus for plug in hybrids with a CO2 emission level between 21 and 60 grams per kilometer. However, the proposal does not include anything about the conversion premium for scrapping a 10-year-old diesel car for the purchase of a plug-in hybrid. The purchase bonus for non-rechargeable hybrid vehicles will be eliminated. Topic. Controversies Piggyback on French subsidies in September 2013, several French news outlets reported that according to the Norwegian newspaper Dagens Næringsliv, some car dealers in Norway have been buying electric cars in France and earning the €7,000 government subsidy. These cars are then imported to Norway and after discounting the freight costs, they are sold at a discount. Dagens Nairings Live cited the case of one dealer near Oslo with 70% of its electric car sales corresponding to vehicles imported from France, and with at least 40 Leafs imported, totaling €280,000 in benefits at a cost of the French taxpayers. These dealers took advantage of a loophole in the French law, which only requires to have an address in the country when buying a new car. Topic. Sales The stock of light-duty plug-in electric vehicles registered in France passed the 100,000-unit milestone in October 2016, making the country the second-largest plug-in market in Europe after Norway. It ranked also as the world's fifth-largest plug-in market after the US, China, Japan and Norway. As of December 2017, a total of 149,797 light-duty plug-in electric vehicles have been registered in France since 2010. The plug-in electric stock consisted of 92,256 all-electric passenger cars, 25,269 all-electric utility vans, and 32,272 plug-in hybrids. Until 2013, most plug-in cars registered in France were pure electric cars, but from 2015, sales of plug-in hybrid cars rose significantly. After the introduction of super bonus for the scrappage of old diesel power cars in April 2015, sales of both segments of plug-in cars surged. The plug-in passenger car segment achieved a record market share of 1.98% of new car registrations in 2017. As of December 2015, France is the country with the world's largest market for light-duty electric commercial vehicles or utility vans. 
Nearly half of the electric vans sold in the European Union are sold in France as a result of a national purchase incentive scheme, which French companies have embraced. The market share of all electric utility vans reached a market share of 1.22% of new vans registered in 2014, and 1.30% 1 in 2015. Topic. 2010–2012 Electric car registrations increased from 184 units in 2010 to 2,630 in 2011. Sales in 2012 increased 115% from 2011 to 5,663 electric cars, making France the world's fourth largest all-electric country market, with an 11% market share of global all-electric car sales in 2012. All-electric car sales in the French market for 2011 were led by the Citroën C0 with 645 units followed by the Peugeot Ion with 639 vehicles and the Ballore Blue Car with 399 units. During 2012, all electric car registrations in France were led by the Blue Car with 1,543 units, the C0 with 1,409, and the Ion with 1,335, together representing 76% of all electric car sales that year. The Renault Kangoo ZE was the top-selling utility electric vehicle with 2,869 units registered in 2012, capturing 82% of the segment sales. The Renault Twizy electric quadricycle, launched in March 2012, sold 2,232 units during 2012, surpassing the Ballore Blue Car, the top-selling highway-capable electric car, and ranked as the second-best-selling plug-in electric vehicle after the Kangoo ZE. <laughs> Thirteen. Registrations reached 8,779 electric cars in 2013, up 55.0% from 2012, and the all-electric market share of total new car sales went up to 0.49% from 0.3% in 2012. In addition, 5,175 electric utility vans were registered in 2013, up 42% from 2012, and representing a market share of 1.4% of all new light commercial vehicles sold in 2013. Sales of electric passenger cars and utility vans totaled 13,954 units in 2013, capturing a combined market share of 0.65% of these two segments' new car sales. When accounting together sales of pure electric cars and light utility vehicles, France was the leading European all-electric market in 2012 and 2013. A total of 666 plug-in hybrids were registered during 2012. The segment sales were led by the Toyota Prius PHV, with 413 registrations, followed by the Opel Impera with 190. During 2013 a total of 800 plug-in hybrids were sold, up 20% from 2012, with the Prius PHEV continuing as the segment leader with 393 units, followed by the Volvo V60 PHEV with 241 units and the Porsche Panamera SE Hybrid with 90 units. When plug-in hybrid sales in 2013 are accounted for, a total of 14,762 plug-in electric vehicles were registered in France in 2013, making the country to rank second in the plug-in European market after the Netherlands, which sold 28,673 plug-in electric vehicles in 2013. During 2013, registrations of pure electric cars were led by the Renault Zoe with 5,511 units representing 62.8% of total electric car sales, followed by the Nissan Leaf with 1,438 units. 
Registrations of all electric light utility vehicles were led by the Renault Kangoo ZE with 4,174 units, representing 80.7% of the segment sales. During 2013 several electric cars from major manufacturers were launched in France. Tesla Model S deliveries to retail customers began in September 2013, the BMW i3 was launched in October, and the Volkswagen e-up, in November. Topic. 2014 A total of 15,045 all-electric cars and vans were registered in 2014, up 7.8% from 2013. With 10,560 cars registered in 2014, up 20.3% from the previous year, sales of all-electric vehicles passed the 10,000-unit milestone for the first time. This figure rises to 10,968 units if the BMW i3 with range extender is accounted for. All electric utility vans continued to be a significant share of the all electric segment, with 4,485 units registered in 2014, but down 13.3% from 2013. All electric cars captured a 0.59% market share of the 1.7 million new car registered in France in 2014, while pure electric utility vans reached a 1.22% market share of their segment. Combined both segments represented a market share of 0.70% of new registrations in the country in 2014. Light duty all electric vehicle sales achieved its best monthly volume on record ever in December 2014, with 2,227 units registered, twice the volume registered the same month in 2013. The slowdown in sales that took place in the French EV market during the first half of 2014, allowed Norway, with 18,649 new all-electric vehicles registered, to end 2014 as the top-selling European market in the all-electric segment, with France ranking second, between 2012 and 2014. Cumulative plug-in hybrid registrations reached 2,985 units, rising cumulative French registrations of plug-in electric vehicles since 2005 to 46,590 units, just ahead of the Netherlands 45,020, and making France the European country where there were more plug-in electric vehicles on the road as of December 2014. The Zoe continued leading plug-in electric vehicle registrations in 2014, with 5,970 units registered, followed by the Kangoo ZE van with 2,657 registrations, and the Nissan LEAF ranked next with 1,600 units. Plug-in hybrid car registrations totaled 1,527 units in 2014, almost doubling registrations from a year earlier. Plug-in hybrid sales were driven by the Mitsubishi Outlander PHEV, with 820 units registered in 2014, representing 54% of the segment registrations in France that year. Topic 2015 A total of 22,695 light-duty all-electric vehicles were sold in 2015. Sales during this period consisted of 17,779 all-electric cars, up 62.1% from 2014, and 4,916 all-electric utility vehicles, up 9.6% from 2014. All electric cars captured a 0.9% market share of new car sales in 2015, and electric utility vans a 1.30%. Combining sales of the two segments, the market share of battery electric vehicles rises to 1.2%. Sales of plug in hybrids surged in 2015, with 5,006 plug in hybrids registered in France, up 228% from 2014. 
The market share of the plug-in hybrid segment reached a market share of 0.26% of the 1.94 million new car registered in 2015. Light-duty plug-in registrations totaled 27,701 units in 2015. Plug-in passenger cars achieved a market share of 1.17% of total new car registrations in 2015. All electric car registrations in 2015 continued to be led by the Renault Zoe with 10,406 units, followed by the Nissan Leaf with 2,220 and the Bolloré Blue Car with 1,166 units. The all-electric utility van segment was led by the Kangoo ZE with 2,836 units sold, up 6.7% from 2014. The plug-in hybrid segment was led by the Volkswagen Golf GTE with 1,687 units, followed by the Audi A3 e-tron with 1,123, and the Mitsubishi Arlander PHEV with 907. Topic 2016 A total of 33,774 light-duty electric vehicles were registered in France in 2016, making the country the third largest in Europe in 2016 after Norway and the UK. France was the top-selling European market in the light-duty all-electric segment with 27,307 units registered, up 23% from 2015. Total registrations in 2016 consisted of 21,751 all-electric cars, 5,556 electric utility vans and 6,467 plug-in hybrid cars. The plug-in car segment achieved a market share of 1.40% of new car registrations in the country in 2016. The Renault Zoe, with 11,404 units registered in 2016, ranked as the top-selling pure electric car for the fourth year on a row, followed by the Nissan Leaf with 3,887 units, and the BMW i3 with 1,347 both variants. The top-selling plug-in hybrids were the Volkswagen Golf GTE with about 1,060 units, followed by the Volvo XC90 with 742 units, and the Audi A3 e-tron with 659. The Renault Kangoo Z again ranked as the top-selling utility van with 2,389 units registered. Topic. 2017 A total of 41,724 light-duty plug-in electric vehicles were registered in France in 2017 consisting of 24,910 all-electric cars, 6,011 electric utility vans and 10,803 plug-in hybrid cars. The plug-in car segment achieved a market share of 1.98% of new car registrations in the country in 2017, with pure electric cars representing 1.47% and plug-in hybrids 0.51% of total registrations. The all-electric Renault Zoe for the fifth year running, continued as the top-selling plug-in electric car with 15,245 units registered in 2017. The Renault Kangoo ZE ranked one more time as the top-selling electric van with 2,546 units registered in 2017. The Mercedes-Benz GLC, launched in the second semester of 2016, topped plug-in hybrid registrations with 2,112 units in 2017. As of December 2017, the Renault Zoe is the all-time best-selling plug-in electric vehicle in the French market with 48,582 units registered since 2012. Ranking second was the Kangoo ZE utility van with 15,032 units registered through September 2016. 
As of September 2016, the Nissan Leaf ranked third with 8,979 units, followed by the Ballore Blue Car with 5,689 units. Most units of the Blue Car are in operation for the Autolib car sharing service in Paris, and similar schemes in Lyon and Bordeaux. Topic. Top selling all electric models by year The following table presents registrations of light duty highway capable all electric vehicles by type all electric cars and vans, and plug in hybrids with detailed all electric car registrations by model between 2010 and December 2015. See also